two ex-NBA stars, Grant Hill and Brent Berry. I'm Brian Anderson. We've got Allie LaForce on the sidelines tonight as well. Inside. Jokic. And Jokic throws it down hard. Oh, 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 there's Serbia. Jokic up there. Ball into the lane. Back to Vucevic. Martin pulls it in. One thing you got to love about Nikola Vucevic is that on offense, he does it all. For big, he's got a terrific three-point shot. And of course, he regularly posts big point totals. I love this approach. Getting him involved early and it's already paying off. Well, he's going to just keep going now. That's early confidence for him. And it's DeRozan missing. Well, there's no denying that Vucevic's offensive output really makes him a great example of a modern big. Yeah, his abilities at long range definitely help stretch the floor. But he can also be an old school menace down low, gobbling up rebounds and owning the paint. The defensive effort was lacking a bit, but hey, give him credit for finding a weakness there. Just really smart basketball and exploiting whatever holes that he's seeing right now in the defensive squad. Here's Jokic. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Jokic got eight. Coming out hot. Four out of five. This could be a big game for him. They get it back. Vucevic. Hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D. Well, Vucevic has finished a couple times in the top ten of offensive boards, in part because of his feel for the game. Here's Morris. Five to shoot. And here's Porter outside. Rebound by the Bulls. And this game, the first chance they've had to see Denver. And he commits the intentional foul. Well, I mean, I'm just not sure what he was thinking right there. I mean, he needs to get his head in the game. Back to Vucevic. And Vucevic slams it in. This is a talent Levine is constantly developing. His assist numbers just keep improving. Martin with it. Guarded now by Ball. And it's Morris penetrating. Oh, and a slam dunk by Morris. Is that an answer or what? He just one up him real good. Yeah, those two relish going at each other, don't they? Everything right except the finish. Have to keep focus all the way through the play. Still Denver's ball. Nice deflection there. Really trying to disrupt their offensive flow. Yeah, I appreciate the work right now on the defensive end. Now here's Jokic. Give him eight points now. And he trains me. A solid five for six now. And a couple of teams coming out scorching hot this season, Grant. How far can a hot start carry a team? Well, some teams can ride a strong start throughout the whole season. I mean, it's just a huge mental boost for a team, particularly early on. Here's Morris. The Bulls making their last shot. Down low. And that one's good. Dozier. And guys, the way this defense is getting manhandled down low, you have to wonder if they're at 100% right now. Caruso misses. Denver in the lead. To the inside. Gordon. Ooh, good finish at the rack off the slick feed. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. Good execution. They're getting some short-range looks here. Now here's Morris. He came away with 14 points in his last game. Back to Gordon. And yep, it's good. The big story thus far, how well they've shot the rock. Ladies and gentlemen, the So he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. 
Have a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Nuggets. Guys, right from the start, it's been apparent they're determined to establish a presence in the paint. I'm loving the ping pong action of the ball tonight. A decent number of assists so far. Wait, bro. Good on the second one. 58 seconds left to play in the first. To the paint. Here's Jokic. That shot off the mark. That's going up against a defense that knows your tendencies. Pass to Bradley. Kick out to Brown. Crosses over. Rips it. Oh, oh, a terrific move. The big time throwdown. Check him out. Keeps the grip on that rim after the finish. A little extra emphasis. Exactly how you want to dive into the game. Picks up his first foul right off the bat. Back to Gordon. And he was camped in the lane there. He gets a three second call. Chicago trailing here. Here's Caruso. Here's Johnson. Oh, and Johnson slams it in. The B.A., when he gets the rim in his sights, it's tough to stop. So aggressive and a determined finisher. Nice. Right side green. Back to Rivers. For three, Gordon. Oh, and the release was before the buzzer, but it's off target. And at the end of one, both teams putting up some points. And we hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even on the scoreboard so far. All right, guys, what do you think about the Nuggets here in this one? You can really see the strategy coming in. Get the ball into the painted area. You don't see that all that often getting down there and doing that much damage in a quarter. You got to respect the game plan. The Bulls making a switch here. Here's Paul. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That one's good. Paul's got his first bucket in this one. It was so hard to knock Bronzo Ball off his center of gravity. That time, a good job of keeping his composure around the challenge. Here's Campazzo. But no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. And just a great job of getting there first and absorbing the contact. And here are the Bulls now. They trail by one. On the wing, Levine. Here's Dozier. sequence in its entirety. Momentum swing, and you love the effort here. But that play never gets old. The pick and roll will still be an offensive staple 100 years from now. Trust me. And it's Green missing. Outside Levine. Shoots from 12. Here's Vucevic. And count it. Now five for seven. He had no answer defensively inside. Down low. Here's Green. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. And Grant, you were a big wing. with skill. That type of player very much in demand in today's game. Well, I mean, today's NBA is all about versatility. 
versatility. Can you get it done offensively and defensively? Players with size and perimeter skills are very much in the team. some solid offense. A moment to hear from Allie LaForce. Hey, Brian. Well, we know this about Jamal Murray. He is not shy of letting that thing go. He said, quote, anyone that knows me knows this. I'm going to take the last shot. I've always believed that, envisioned that, dreamed that, and practiced that. Yeah, I'm going to make it. Guys, there's no denying that confidence. Well, it serves him well, right, Allie? Thanks for that. There's an ease to quarter when he gets up vertically. Man, he can rise up and throw it down. Well, a high level four general is what you get in Monte Morris, who's out there creating and not turning it over. Yeah, good whistle there. Yeah, the first one at the line is good. You know, you talk to the coaching staff here, they rave about Morris's high basketball IQ. Well, anytime that coaches can put a guy in to slow down or speed up the offense and know that he's not going to just hand the ball to the other team, that's a luxury. Pass to DeRosa. Puts the move on. That one, no good. Green with the defensive effort. Porter gets the bucket. Porter's got his second basket of the game. And Porter's height and length around the basket is going to help him create opportunities to score. Here's Morris. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Assisted P.J. And almost four minutes gone in the second quarter play. Yeah, he tried to gain position. He didn't quite get there. Substitution for the Bulls. Alice A. Johnson. Jones Jr. Here's Caruso. As far as his production, he's averaging about eight points per game. There's the screen by Johnson. To the inside. Good setup. Led to the right perfectly for the layup. This can make it so much easier for your teammate when you throw that lead pass that gets to him right on the money, whether that's on the run or in the shooting pocket. Over to the left wing. Back to Morris. That one's wide left. Chicago trailing here. Pass to Bradley. Here's Jones. Drops in the three. Jones has got five points. Defensively, got to close out a little faster. That's a look he'll make with regularity. Seconds left to play in the half. And the ball will be against Nikola Jokic. That's his first foul of the game. And this kind of selflessness is great to see. Textbook positioning to draw the charge. And so here is Chicago. They trail by one. Looking ahead, they've got the Mavericks coming to town for their next one. And that game will conclude a four-game homestand for them. On the wing, Barton. He gets it up. Oh, got it off in time, but it's no good. And a pretty tight 
contested game here as we end the first half. Nuggets ahead, leading by one. And don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during halftime. The shot's good. Aaron Gordon. Gordon's got his third bucket of the night. Coaches love to see ball movement, especially when it gets you that kind of look. Levine attacking. And the basket is good. Just a really gifted athlete. Levine's speed makes him an effective penetrator. Here's Gordon. And it's cleared by Vucevic. Right side, Levine. They double-team Levine. Good work defensively by Gordon. Denver in the lead. Morris outside. Pass to Gordon. Lays it up and banks it in. Gordon's got eight. Their defense just falls apart once the ball goes inside. And they go to the intentional foul. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. On the wing, Levine. Consistent production from him. Averaging just over 26 a game. Here's DeRozan. Just five to shoot. Levine with it. Double. And the masterful defensive job by Barton as the shot's going up. That length certainly can alter some shots if used correctly. Did you see that? I mean, going right to the rim, that's how you finish in the open floor. Yeah, anything other than a layup in that situation probably get into the <laughs> That's the sauce right there. I mean, every night, Levine approaches the rim like it's a dunk contest. Alonzo Ball really working on his shot and starting to find the consistency that one would hope for, but it's all the other things he does, the rebounds, the assists, the steals. I mean, he really contributes to all levels of the game. Ball outside. And here's Levine. Here's Vucevic. Oh, Jokic with the block. Jokic using all seven feet there. Good effort by the serve. That one drops four. He's got 12. Another area you see Lonzo's diverse skill set is in his shooting ability. Well, that's the one not coming in. And he's just showing people now that he can step up and knock those down. So close range or at the arc, Lonzo getting more and more comfortable and confident in his offensive ability. Ball left side. Back to Caruso. Pass to Jones. Up and over Gordon. Here's Vucevic. And the power finish by Vucevic. And that really has to lift his teammates' spirits right now. I'll tell you, Grant, these second chance buckets could be what this game comes down to. Well, especially in a close game, every possession matters. That's 10 straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. Pass to Caruso. DeRozan for three. The offensive rebound. Oh, Takes a three. And out of bounds. Denver will have it. Denver ball. Both teams deciding to change it up. Just over three and a half minutes through the third. Here's Green. The kick out to Barton. Launches it. And that comes off the assist by Green. Barton's got five points now in the quarter. And you can see how dangerous that catch and shoot game can be when Barton continues to impress. Bradley, that's good. I just think that's trouble. You're gonna you're gonna let that guy shoot layups. You're asking for it. Martin shot off the mark. And it's the Bulls with the ball. Six-point game. The kick out to Johnson. 
Here's Caruso. That one doesn't drop. Green with the defensive effort. Oh, and Bradley with the block. And the whistle blew, so that'll be a shooting foul. Hey, great defensive effort there with the block shot, but he got more than just the ball that time. Free throw is coming up. And he makes it first. I think Will Barton has figured out that scoring from the free throw line can be a good thing. And he makes the first, but misses the second. Left side Levine. Back to Caruso. Drives to the hoop. The layup misses. Back come the Nuggets on the run. Here's Barton. Finished off the break. Barton's got eight. Boy, his game is all about speed. He gets out quickly on the break there and finishes that too. It'll count. No luck on that one. And so it's the Denver Nuggets. They have a nice nine-point cushion at the end of the quarter. And it's all due to their ability to own. It's the fourth, the fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you. Boy, this offense has been dynamic and diversified. Just everyone shooting the ball and shooting the ball makes it difficult to defend. Chicago trailing here. And so they choose to intentionally foul. Jamal Green. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. DeRozan outside. And a foul call on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. He'll go on Michael Porter. You know, DeRozan has been lucky. He gained so much valuable experience in his career, playing on diverse all-star and Olympic teams. You can tell he's feeling confident right now at the line, and when he's on, he can be lights out. It's stolen by Green. Pass the ball. Ooh, too long in the paint, and he's hit with a three-second violation. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Nuggets. They haven't been pushed around in the paint at all in this game. They've been the aggressors. They have not wasted any time here. They've pushed it whenever they've had the opportunity and have gotten a lot of fast break points out of it. And the call will be against Nikola Jokic. That's foul number two for him. They're having a hard time with fouls. It's still early, but one more and they'll be over the limit. Here's Green. Green, a screen. Just five on the clock. Got a piece of it. Fourth quarter just getting started. One minute in the books. Out to the right wing. Here's Tosha. Misses the three. Chicago with the ball. Here in the fourth quarter, their defense has been very strong. No baskets allowed. And the basket by DeRozan. And he just moves so well without the ball. DeRozan stays locked and loaded for catch and shoot opportunities. Morris finds some space. Monte Morris. That ball. Nice feed from Jokic. And the Nuggets lead by five. Right side, Levine. Porter pulls it in. Pass to Gordon. No good. So the Bulls will take it the other way. Here's Levine for three. Porter pulls it in. Well, his shots aren't dropping, and they haven't been able to keep pace, but they trust him enough to keep going to him, see if he can find him. Very sick from three. They feel like there's nowhere on the floor where you can really get away from Michael Porter Jr. Three ball goes that time. Jokic is rolling, and you can see the coaching staff over there applauding everything he's doing.
third minute of action now gone here on the floor. It falls again. He's now 8 for 12 on the floor. And Yoke is right using now. those muscles. Yeah, they're in there. Now the defense is slow. Outside, green. The three-pointer off the mark. Well, even though he misses that one, the defense has got to talk about that. And that's a bad miscue. And you can't give up looks like that all game long. In for the Nuggets. 146 left to play in the fourth quarter of this one. Here's Barton. Oh, he goes up high for the two-handed slam. I know sometimes it looks out of control, but his dribble play can be effective. Barton there with the handle and the deuce. Oh, Barton there a minute 40 left left in the fourth quarter and the basket by DeRozan yeah here's a list of things I don't want to do and right at the top is guard that guy pass to Jokic Gordon can't hit the Bulls on offense they trail by 11 Gordon with a steal Good. Five for nine shooting so far. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. Well, I know they don't have mobile devices out there in the next team, so they might as well talk to one of them. Good movement from Vucevic there. Seeing a lane open, forcing the D to compromise on the drive. And that one falls, so he hits both of them. A minute six left to the fourth quarter here. Here are the Nuggets with the ball. Now a 14 to six run. Nothing left to do but to watch the clock tick towards zero. Nice victory here for the Nuggets. Absolute fireworks display. High scoring game. They were unstoppable. Yeah, just relentless from start to finish. And the pace was furious. Ultimately, they wore out the other team. And this will give them their seventh win of the year. Always good to start a season series off with a W. They show tonight they take this team seriously, and the next two matchups between these two should be fun. And when you look at the game, the one thing that helped fuel this team to victory was the efficiency for Nikola Jokic. Just really loved his activity level here tonight. Constantly mixed it up, and he threw himself into a lot of plays. Yeah. And it's cleared by Vucevic. Pass to Caruso. Vucevic gets the bucket. This is Vucevic's comfort zone. Even when the D is good, his offense is sometimes just bad. So no problem for Denver. As they, get the win, they have to feel good about this performance. It's what they can be for. I mean, when you're out of the road, Right now. Ready? Ooh, what a game for the mother. Did you win? Denver Nuggets, Nick and Nuggets. 18 7, 3, 2. Barton, double figures. Aaron Gordon, double figures. Porter, oh. Morris. Dozier had a nice game, too, in defense. Couple steals. Mm -hmm. Too many fast break points. They held them to zero fast break points. Points in the paint. Uh, let's go.